On Friday, July 15, 2016, Farmer Veteran Coalition of Michigan joined forces with NRCS, MSU Extension, Michigan Conservation Districts, and the Michigan Ag and Environmental Assurance Program in East Lansing for a soil health workshop. With over 30 on hand, its purpose was to offer military veterans and active duty personnel and their families the opportunity to learn about the science and management behind good soil health, cover cropping, no-till and low-till practices, erosion mitigation, and nutrient management. Farmer Veteran Coalition's mission is to mobilize veterans to feed America. They do it through veteran-to-veteran -veteran connections with education, resource opportunities, and programming. But a challenge many veterans face is one all too familiar with young farmers in our state. Access to financial resources uh, as far as capital and infrastructure like land and equipment is, is a huge barrier for beginning farmers. One of the things that Farmer Veteran Coalition does to address that is we have a fellowship program that our members are eligible to apply for. So every year we open up an application that allows our veteran uh, members to apply for a one to $5,000 grant for things like education, equipment, uh, things that, that help build their infrastructure to make them more successful and sustainable on the farm. So that's one possible avenue. But we're also working with a lot of different nonprofits across the state, including, including Michigan Food and Farming Systems, to identify land access opportunities for veterans that may be a little bit outside of the traditional scope. One of those types of things looks like, what it looks like would be basically uh, transitional. So a lot of our, our farmers are aging and, and the, uh, we all know that the, the mean age of, of farmers here in Michigan is around 58 years old. So as those individuals start to retire from agriculture, oftentimes there is not a family member to take over the farm. So we're working with MIFs to help identify transitional processes that help individuals that may own farms now uh, connect with a veteran so that they can transition those farms to a veteran owner. And oftentimes this, this becomes something that the landowner themselves really becomes excited about because they're giving an opportunity to a local hero to take that, that farm that they've built over the course of their life and continue it. Along with land access programs, FVC Michigan members have the opportunity to win farm machinery through an online competitive application process through the Farm Equipment Exchange and Donation or FEED program. On this day, a reconditioned 1976 Chevy C65 farm truck from Peterson Farms Incorporated of Shelby, Michigan was awarded to Marine Corps veteran Matt Van Wormer, owner of Toad Hall Farm in Emmett. The most important thing that we're seeing happen here today, and this is something that Farmer Veteran is at, Coalition is absolutely passionate about, is the veteran to veteran connection. Uh, oftentimes, veterans are not the first people to ask for help. We uh, oftentimes look to our fellow veterans for help, but you won't see a veteran walk into a USDA office and say, hey, I need a little help on my farm. Now, what you're going to see is you're going to see another veteran connect with them, and that opens up the opportunities for that individual veteran. So we as an organization and we as veterans want to see our fellow veterans succeed here in Michigan agriculture. And if that means me taking an individual into an NRCS office and introducing him into to the staff that's going to help them build a conservation plan on their farm, well, I'm going to absolutely do that. So what we really do, it's, it's all about that veteran to veteran connection. It's the most important bond that you see in the veteran community. And we're happy to help move this forward here in the state of Michigan and with our Michigan farmers. You can learn more about the work of Farmer Veteran Coalition of Michigan at farmvetco.org and visit mifs.org if interested in providing land opportunities for veterans wanting to farm.